It's the kind of technology you'd expect to see in a science lab. This incredible feat of modern farming takes 224 full-time workers, 48 growing rooms, and some very cool machinery. And it all starts with a precise mix of compost and nutrients. The mushroom industry is the original recycler. We take agricultural waste products, we combine it into a substrate that provides food for the mushroom. The Phillips Mushroom Plant in Warwick, Maryland, covers over seven acres and produces 25 million pounds of mushrooms per year, shipping them all throughout the eastern U.S. So this is pretty amazing. The carrier for the mushroom fungus is already incorporated into this substrate. So this will all be wheeled right in and everything to start the process is right here. Once the mixture is on the rack, it's covered in a compost bedding that has the mycelium, or mushroom spores, mixed in. From there, the fungus begins to grow. So that's what the white stuff is. The white stuff is the mushroom fungus? Yes. Okay. So, and that, so it's growing up from the bottom from the bottom through this to the casing. Campus, into the casing. Okay, very interesting. From now on, each room must have very precise settings for temperature, humidity, and carbon dioxide. So are we ready to start growing mushrooms now? Yes, we are. Uh, like 13 days from now, we should start harvesting mushrooms here. By tomorrow, you're actually going to be see the mushroom developing. Ah, it's exciting. When the mushroom finally begins to grow, it's known as the pinning stage. How do you know what's going to be a mushroom? Well, as you can see, here, all the roots are coming together. So oh, yeah. from there, it's going to produce a pin, and then the mushroom's going to grow. So it's all, everything like comes together, and then it's just going to start sprouting up? Yes. So when conditions exciting. are right, mushrooms can grow very quickly, doubling in size every 24 hours. So we're finally getting ready to go in and harvest some mushrooms. But before we go in, I have to put on this smock and wear these gloves for food safety reasons. You ready? Let's go. For the workers, harvesting goes on around the clock. And even though mushrooms don't need light to grow, the lights stay on so that every mushroom can be inspected and picked okay. by hand. Pull the mushroom is don't pull. Grab the mushroom and kind of pull and twist at the same time so you don't bring up dirt. All right. And make holes on the beds because you have a second generation of mushroom coming. Oh. So you grab All it. All right, so grab it, twist, twist it, and, and pull, pull at the same time. So how many mushrooms does one person pick in one day? A lots of pounds. Lots of pounds? Uh, yes. A bed like this can be picked in less than 25 minutes. The workers can tell just by looking at them which mushrooms are ready for harvest. But it's not all about the size. By looking at the stem, color, and shape of the mushroom, they know right away which will stay and which will end up on your grocery store shelves. Most crops take months to grow and are harvested once. But mushrooms are a much different story. They reach harvest in a mere 17 days, and they'll be picked three times. So we're gonna get three batches of mushrooms out of this same bed. Yes, that is correct. How many pounds of mushrooms will this whole entire room produce after all three phases, like all three flushes? It, it will be on average from like 75,000 pounds to 85,000 pounds. Wow. Yes, only out of this room. That's, and how many rooms are here total? 48. Whew. That's a lot of mushrooms. Yes, it is. <laughs> it's also a lot of compost. When the harvest is over, the room is sterilized and emptied. Um, as you can see, it's going to be run out this conveyor. Uh, from here, it's going to go to our local farms, where they're going to spread it out in the field and use the nutrients that still are in this compost. That's awesome that everything gets reutilized in some way, shape, or form. Yes, it's so nothing's wasted. Excellent. <laughs> The end result is high in vitamins B and D, has as much potassium as a banana, and is great for your immune system. In the U.S., we produce nearly 900 million pounds each year. Not surprisingly, those figures continue to mushroom.